There's a point on Earth where zero degrees latitude meets zero degrees longitude. But what's actually there? For centuries, nations couldn't agree on where the world's zero point should be. France wanted Paris. China wanted Beijing. Everyone wanted their own country at the center. The confusion ended in 1884, when representatives from 25 countries met in Washington, D.C. to decide once and for all. They chose Greenwich, London as the prime meridian. From then on, zero degrees longitude would pass through there, separating east from west. Zero latitude was easier. That's the equator circling the middle of the Earth. So where do those two lines cross? Right here, just off the coast of Africa in the Atlantic Ocean. It's not a tropical island paradise, but it is home to a lone buoy, Station 13010 part of a research network tracking weather and climate. But in the digital world, something funny happened. When mapping software encounters errors, bad data often defaults to zero, zero. And so millions of mistakes ended up right here. Geographers jokingly gave it a name, Null Island, a fictional one meter square island where lost data goes to live. In reality, it's just water and a buoy. But in the digital age, Null Island has become the most famous island that doesn't actually exist. Thanks for watching. For more fascinating discoveries from science and history, don't forget to subscribe to LG News.